Hey, what's up guys, Eskizu here and welcome to episode 20 of Skill Into Glory and uh, we're going to start today's episode off by going into the first game of the episode and uh, we basically come up against a 4-3-3 La Liga side with also the 5 star skiller in Ribéry on the left wing spot, a pretty strong team with also attribute card for Ibrahimovic but uh, we do get things started off after 12 minutes, he makes a mistake with his goalkeeper, we almost took advantage of it because as you can see we hit the post for an open net with Aldo Sarri, couldn't believe it, such a big chance already after 12 minutes. Then 25th minute, some nice stuff from Fido Martinez, lovely rainbow flick, maybe should have passed it across to either uh, Pabon or Aldosari, but I couldn't really do much because of the stupid first touch he actually got after he pulled off that rainbow flick, so um, yeah, we continue on 27th minute, another chance, this one with Aldosari, some great stuff, we get a bit lucky there with the step over, but we go through and we do put it into the back of the net, a nice shot giving us the more than deserved lead in this game. Then 33rd minute, he splits through my defense, a great interception from uh, Al Sharani, but then I pass it back to my goalkeeper, I want to pass it back to him, but then Ribéry was there and he makes it 1-1. I just should have booted it forward, but stupid, stupid me, I passed it to Al Sharani, so, so stupid. But then a couple minutes later, I had the exact same thing, this time I booted it forward, a terrible kick from my trap, and as you can see, the lucky bounces were on his side, with Falbuena and then he goes inside the box and he finished it off making it 2-1. A pretty nice finish but it was just so so stupid. One because it was in the 45th minute and it was basically a second chance as well. Two mistakes, two goals, so so stupid. The 45th minute, we're still in that minute. We get ourselves back into the game with Carlos Eduardo making it 2 to where I thought all right, we go into the second half and uh, hopefully we can uh, we can pretty much just get ourselves back into the game completely and take the lead. But then we're still in the 45th minute. Can you believe it? After two goals, straight from kickoff, he manages to get himself another shot in this one with Ibrahimovic and he makes it 3-2. I mean, three goals in the 45th minute. I seriously couldn't believe it. I mean, this game was just completely against me for some reason because I couldn't finish off a single thing in this game as you can see we're only one minute into the second half two huge chances already and this is how it pretty much would go in the second half as well in the first half we had a lot of chances we did manage to score twice but the second half was seriously even worse man i mean the first 10 minutes it was just it was just drama all over the place here another big chance with Pabon, couldn't finish it off then uh, only a minute later or so, again Pabon on the ball there, nice burpee spin, we cut through there, we get a bit lucky there with the bounce, then we do get a shot in as well, and we end up hitting the post, another big chance, and then 63rd minute, I already saw it coming, he played on through to Valbuena, turns around, shoots, and makes it 4-2, I mean, it was the third chance yet in this game, it was just unbelievable, after that he, he had a couple of chances as well to make it like 5-2, 6-2, unfortunately for him anyway that, that that wasn't the case. And we also had another huge chance with Pabon. And this is how the game ended, ended up losing 4-2 as you can see from the stats. It was just crazy that we actually lost this game 4-2. But that is how FIFA goes sometimes. Sometimes it is completely against you and sometimes everything that you try just goes into the back of the net. Anyway, we're going to be the second game of the episode. Come up against a full bronze team and with also a silver center back in the 4-4-2 formation. 82 chemistry. And we start things off after 4 minutes with Cardona. Some nice skin was inside the box and a great finish into the top corner giving us the early lead in this game. Then 15 minute to this uh, Aldo Sari on the right hand side with some nice skills as well I first thought we were going to lose the ball there but we managed to go through that we go inside the box a nice a nice Bolasi flick to a first time volley making it 2-0 a beautiful finish there from him and a great way to actually extend the lead. Then we continue on still in the first half. It is uh, Fido Martinez on the right hand side with some great skill moves. Uh, we cut in there with the Balassi flick in between those two defenders. Goes for the fake Arbona to a near post shot with his weak foot. A great, great save there from his goalkeeper. Very, very close picking up his uh, sixth goal. Then 45th minute, Pabon on the ball. Tried to go for a long shot since we were very, very close in the previous episodes. And finally we managed to smash it into the back of that with his outside foot as well. You can see it from the replay. This is actually why I really, really like the goal. Love the way it actually went in. And then more importantly, we finally complete the challenge. I was really, really happy that we actually ended off the first half in an amazing way. Uh, then we move it in the second half. It is Fido Martinez on the left-hand side. Again, with some nice skill. Moose cuts in there with the McGeady spin. Goes with a weaker shot with his weak foot, actually. But this time, he does manage to put it into the back of that. Makes it 4-0. Picks up his sixth goal in total as well. We're only one goal away, actually, by uh, completing another challenge. So uh, that was definitely something I was trying to do in this game. Uh, then all of a sudden, we get a pretty nice skill run going with Carlos Eduardo. I tried to go for a shot. We completely failed. 
then we do get a shot and after a nice roulette making it 5-0 and uh, that is just basically how the game would end up we do get uh, another chance here with Fido Martinez in the 90th minute trying to get his final goal uh, as you can see a little bit too many skill moves there uh, on the left side still we manages to go through that with some great skill moves got in with the step overs getting another step over in and then we get tackled and we pick up a penalty so it was the perfect perfect place to actually pick up his final goal we can guess it already his goalkeeper actually saved it so um, there was a big opportunity to complete another challenge in this game unfortunately it didn't happen but uh, we still had one game left in this episode so uh, it was another another chance to basically pick up the final goal with him and complete the challenge so uh, that was definitely something i was i was looking forward to so uh, we're going to be the final game of the episode and we come up against a pretty interesting hybrid team some players from the scottish league from the from the hellas league the greek league and also from the k league the korean one and it was actually a subscriber i played against and this guy was actually pretty good he got the first chance with Griffiths a good save from a goalkeeper then at 29th minute we got the chance here as well with uh, Fido Martinez some great skill as well tried to go for a shot which just got blocked off by the defender then we got a volley in with Cardona great shot as well again a good save from his keeper then uh, from that corner we uh, we go on another run here with Aldo Sarri from a corner tried to go for a shot here from a pretty impossible angle completely blew that one completely busted over the bar then uh, from that goal kick he goes through there he picks it up there with Ainsworth plays it on through there I think to Rogic plays it on through to uh, Griffiths was all of a sudden pretty much through my defense and then he makes it 1-0 with a really really nice shot across goal and that uh, gives him the lead in the game then 37th minute he has the ball there again with Ainsworth plays it on through there to a Santos goes for a shot there at the near post a good good save for my goalkeeper because he probably could have passed it across as well to Griffiths and made it 2-0 would have been worse for us then it was still in the first stuff some nice stuff from Carlos Eduardo LTRT during a lovely dummy from Pabon plays on through to Cardona goes for a shot from some distance but a good save uh, from his goalkeeper yet again then we move it into the second half first him on the ball with Roji plays it on through to Santos cuts in there beats my defender Thiago Silva with a nice turn and then a shot at the near post this time it went in to be honest though terrible goalkeeping there from Trapp uh, didn't really understand what he was trying to do and then he gets himself another chance, I think, with Santos as well. Probably could have been a 3 0 line game over, but this time Trap was there with a great, great save. Uh, then we continue on in the 80th minute. We do finally get a goal here with our CDM, actually, Ellen, to make it 2 1, but it was a little bit too late. And as you probably can see from the stats as well, it was a more than deserved win for my opponent, so uh, fair play to him. I actually don't think it actually happened before that. We lost two games in one episode, but it was just a complete off day for me when it came to playing FIFA that day. Anyway, as you can see, we do have seven games left with Fido Martinez. Currently, we have scored six games goals with him and we have three challenges left so hopefully we are able to complete them in the next episode and then move it to the next five star skiller which is going to be El Nusi. anyway guys it's going to be the end of this video still hope you enjoyed it despite not really the greatest gameplay if you did then make sure to leave a like would be very much appreciated so thank you very much for watching and i will see you guys later bye, -bye.